Lee says, we had this request in from a customer. Any ideas on how to achieve this? They want to create a Microsoft 365 calendar that allows for room bookings to be made with a number of options incorporated into the bookings, such as the ability to choose whether food is required, breakfast or lunch, uh, et cetera. When the booking is made, the food request is stored in the calendar entry and also sent to a specific person to arrange the food. Any ideas if that is possible? Yes, there are custom questions that you can add to any of your services. So any of your booking pages, your services, you can set up questions that they have to answer and make them required. And then that becomes part of the email that goes to confirm. The only piece I don't know about is if there's a, like if you can't route it based on the answers, it goes to the same person no matter what. And you can set up a PowerShell to say if there's a new a new entry in the calendar that it will go forwarded to another person. but. Not, you know, if it's breakfast, go to Susie. If it's lunch, go to Bob. You can't do that. Um, so, yeah, I would create a, a services with the custom questions. And I left yeah. the link special for you. Yeah, there there are. Uh, I know we we um, almost every time we record the series of answer a bunch of questions this with this small team. Almost every time there's a calendaring question that's in there. <laughs> um, every time. Yeah. You might think it's a common issue. Hmm. Yeah. yeah. It, 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 but something like this, when you're adding more complexity to that, I mean, how else were you? I mean, because uh, the other thing you could do, I mean, you could create a Microsoft list um, and you have a calendar view for those items. And so you could then create some automations around that. If people answer a certain way that it sent a notification to an individual. Um, so, uh, you know, but that, then the problem is then that calendar view of a list is disconnected from the, an actual calendar. Right. It's not the same. The bookings calendar is not the same as like a personal calendar. And I don't know the integrations. I'm going to have to investigate what integrations they have with bookings because I know certain applications in Microsoft 365, those, uh, you know, uh, actions or connectors that they have are very robust and, like forms, there's not a you know, there's a lot, but um, other ones not so much. So I'm wondering if I have to look into that.